Hey guys, Ryan King here, and I'm the keyboard instructor for WorshipArtistry.com. In today's YouTube lesson, we're going to take a look at the song Real Love by Hillsong Young and Free. Specifically, we're going to look at the instrumental. Now, we're only going to look at the instrumental, so if you want to see the entire lesson, you need to click the link and head over to Worship Artistry where you can sign up for an account for less than 10 bucks a month, and it's totally worth it. With that, you get access to our entire catalog of over 300 songs, plus all of our resources like sheet music, guitar tabs, drum tabs, practice loop videos, our full music video playthrough, even our rehearsal mix that we use. And so uh, you really want to go over, sign up, and check it out. But in case you just want to check out a YouTube video, this is for you. The instrumental is a lot of fun. This is where we have a really cool groove, and it's also where we get to play uh, this vocal part that is you know, very recognizable in this song. And when you put it together, it looks like this. One, two, three, and... Pretty cool. Now, to break it down as far as the sounds, we've dropped our OB pluck. We're still using our clubbing voices number three, Tony Banks, Big and Slow Air, as well as the clubbing voices sound, which is our, you know, that main um, vocal lead line that we're playing. And then we're adding in our super fade, which is that big super saw sound that kind of fades in. Now, in our left hand, we're doing some of the same chords that you've already learned. We're playing G, B minor, A, then up to D down to D over D sharp, again G, B minor, A, D, over F sharp, back to G. And our right hand, our melody is this. Now the second part of it is a lot easier than the first part, and again we're playing some ghost notes here, or grace notes, um, depending on what you want to call them, and if we just break it down to just the melody, it sounds like this. One, two, three, four, one. <laughs> Now that's just the melody, that didn't include all the little grace notes. When we add the grace notes in, it sounds like this. Two, three, four. So you can see how those grace notes add a lot of character to the overall sound. You've got some syncopation there, so really kind of slow that thing down and work through it. When you add both your right hand and left hand again, it sounds like this. One, two, three, and... So again, that's the instrumental. Make sure you take a look at your sheet music down below, work through the loop video a few times. Let's move on to the next part of the lesson.